Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Lil Clay Clay. Um, and today I have a very uh, special vlog. It's it's Friday, uh, 10.04. Um, and guess what just came a few minutes ago, or a few seconds ago really, in the mail today. My new hyper tough weed eater. I've always been needing a weed eater. Um, as you know, I've done several videos about one to get one. I was, was going to buy uh, uh, Murray off of Macari. That, that didn't work out. Um, I was going to buy a, a Lawn Master, which had an easy start. But when I saw how much money I was going to lose out of my account, I'm actually glad I didn't buy that one because I they did yesterday I went to Target and I actually only have literally, well, I'm not going to say, but basically enough money to buy maybe a bunch of candy at Dollar General. I'll put it at that. <laughs> Um, next week is the monthly type, which takes more money, like a whole bunch. But, you know, if you're doing it to give to the Lord, it's, you know, worth it. But anyway, I ended up going with this $98 Hyper Tough trimmer I ordered off of Walmart. Um, I did look at this, but then I did change my mind when I saw the Mary on Macari, but I'll be honest, I'm glad I got this. Um, this was my, I mean, I tried to... I mean, if I could, I got a still, but, you know, they just, I just couldn't afford to get one, at least at a dealership, so that's pretty much where you, only place you, where you can get stills nowadays, so, um, I decided just to buy this, and it's a pretty good, looks like a pretty good weed eater, um, I also got one of my work, by the way, it's an older one, I'll show you guys that one in the next work vlog, but, so, um, one cool thing is it comes with string, um, it's a dual line bump feed. Hopefully that doesn't mean it's one where you have to wind the string on yourself. If it is, I might see if I can replace it with uh, one where it where it's a speed feed. Or I might see if I can find one that doesn't work with Hyper Tough but is compatible. Um, also, as you can see, it comes with its own lubricant, which means I can just make my own mixed gas, which we did all the time when I worked at STI, and its own string. But anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and take this out of the box and put it together while watching the Olympics in my bedroom since I'm having problems with the TV in the living room and I'll see and I'll see you guys in a minute if you're new here my name is Lil Clay Clay and I have high functioning autism all right so here it is out of the box um turn the light on so you can see a little bit better let me open the blinds here better now so we have the weed eater motor and the pole where you attach the pulley to the well not this isn't where but basically you attach the pole that has the pulley onto the weed eater um, it has this cool styrofoam grip that um can be used to it's a bit hard, but it still makes it kind of comfortable for when you're holding in weed eating. It's the little handle you put on. Next, we have the other pole that has half of the pulley on there. We have the little cover on top that keeps, I think, stuff from being flung from the weed eater. Um, and um, we next have. Mixed gas, well not mixed gas, but the oil that you put in for the mixed gas, which is good because that means you can make your own, which you can, it is safe, we did that all the time at STI, and um, we also have, next we have the other part of the pulley, and as you can see it is a load spool, which means that you don't have to spend hours Building with the little pulley trying to get the string to go in place, which is what I wanted. I hate having to put string in the weed eater. It's not, it's time consuming and it's a pain in the butt. If you have a, if you find one, if you find one that, a weed eater that has a self-loading spool, or if you, or if you have one that doesn't have one, find one that is adaptable for your weed eater. Because it's not worth the time just spending hours winding it on yourself. It's very hard, and I don't think even anyone with ST I could do it. So I hate it because I hate hate doing that at my job. 
goes the gas still weed eater I have ha doesn't have one like this it's actually one with the strings attached to the pulley I'll show you guys what I mean in that blog but anyway here's a little spring I'll put that right there so I don't lose it that basically goes in between these two pulleys I think to help it when you need to hit the button to dispense more weed eater string and then here we have the extra weed eater string that comes with it which is good because that means I now won't have to go to the store for a while to buy some and then right now and then here we have the manual which I may or may not use I mean I'm a pro at putting these together but I may, if I have to do it a certain way I don't think I do and then we have it also comes with a little tool thing whatever to help you put it together I can't remember what these are called but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and put this together, and then soon I'll, and then I'm going to throw the box away that I came in, and then we'll put some gas in it, make my own mixed gas, and then we'll give it a whirl. Okay, here it is all put together. Um, and it didn't take long at all. So as I am a whiz at putting these together, like I said, on um, this, you probably have seen so many of my videos from working at STF, I would most of the time be putting these weed eaters together. And, um, and yep, all I just have to do is tighten a few bolts, have to put all the t attachments on, and I'm good to go. Um, I think I put the handle on a little crooked. It's kind of weird that I got this little plastic one, but it's still going to be worth it. Um, and it looks pretty cool. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go uh, um, get some gas for it. Uh, I'm gonna use make my own mixed gas, and then I will demonstrate. And then I will demonstrate it, well, or, or try to at least. Did pretty good. Well, it does have smoke coming out of it. Hopefully, that doesn't mean I screwed it up. But 
but um, yeah, it's done pretty good, but you know, so I'm gonna finish the weeding. I'm gonna weed it just this part right here, and then do the rest tomorrow. And, um, yeah, it's pretty good. So, got to go ahead and hurry up and do this because it's already starting to get hot. I would have gotten up earlier, but I, but the package came pretty early. They were supposed to, one's supposed to come until later in the day. But um, this is why you don't want an electric weed eater. I just thought I'd point that out. This is all I could get with my Popeyes weed eater. You can't go down to the bottom like you can with the gas-powered one. It won't. It'll either mess the It'll either not do anything or it'll make this chain pop off. Yeah, I'm about to give this thing a whirl. See how well it does.